Okay, go ahead. May I say a few words? I want to say a few words about this matter. I am a woman's rights. I have as much muscle as any man and can do as much work as any man. I've plowed and reaped and husked and chopped and mowed. And can any man do more than that? I've heard much about the sexes being equal. I can carry as much as any man and can eat as much too if I can get it. I'm as strong as any man that is now. As for intellect, all I can say is, if women have a pint and men a quart, why can't she have her little pint full? You need not be afraid to give us our rights for fear we will take too much, for we can't take more than our pint will hold. The poor men seem to be all in confusion and don't know what to do. Why, children, if you have woman's rights, give it to her and you will feel better. You will have your own rights and they won't be so much trouble. I can't read, but I can hear. I've heard the Bible and have learned that Eve caused men to sin. Well, if woman upset the world, do give her a chance to set it right side up again. The lady has spoken about Jesus, how he never spurned woman from him, and she was right. When Lazarus died, Mary and Martha came to him with faith and love and besought him to raise their brother. And Jesus wept, and Lazarus came forth. And how came Jesus into the world? through God who created him and woman who bore him. Man, where is your part? But the women are coming up, blessed be God, and a few of the men are coming up with them. But man is in a tight place. The poor slave is on him, woman is coming on him, and he is surely between a hawk and a buzzard.